Good morning, welcome to today's video. If you're new here, my name is Carrie and I make faith, family, and kids videos. Today's video is gonna be a little vloggy. I'm gonna be taking you around with us as we do stuff today, but I also wanna talk about intermittent fasting. I always thought fasting was just some kind of weird thing that people did, I never looked into it, and I thought maybe it was like a thing that people did religiously or culturally and did not realize just the benefits of intermittent fasting and how it can help you lose weight and everything like that and just regulate your body really so come along with us today first things first we are headed out to an exciting place called the dump and we don't have a trash service that's how you know far in the country we live so we are headed there and then we're also going to drop off some donations if you've been following along with me you know i actually do that quite often at least every couple weeks we're dropping off donations because we are trying to slowly change our life over to more minimal lifestyle and that is another healthy thing to do by the way Obviously, I am struggling with holding this camera on my face. Sorry about that. Um, and then we're also going to hit our local farmer's market. I will record in there one of these days. We'll see if I get any footage today or not. It really just depends. If there's other people in there, it's a really small place. So, I uh, don't want to record. But if it's empty, then we'll see. But anyways, let's get going. water and I sliced up a few slices of lemon and strawberries. We are fasting for 24 hours today at least. He might do more than that. I'm fasting for 24 hours though so I am downing water today. It's gonna be so hard not to eat the strawberries in there. I should mention that my hair is probably going to get crazier as the day goes on uh, because of the windows happen to be down but we're also going to be like doing some manual labor today and I feel like that's going to make our fast a little harder so but this is our first time doing a fast this long so it's kind of a trial run and we're going to figure out what we need to do to be better at it next time or how we want to work it like maybe work it on a Sunday where we're just doing a lot of chilling or whatever but we will um, keep you guys updated on that it is only 9 30 in the morning so we still have plenty of time to go before we hit the 24 hours I think the last night we ate at like what, what was it 7 30 the last time we ate yeah, probably around 7.30, 8-ish, like the last bite of food, you know? Um, so, we we got like 11 hours. Is that right? 11 hours? Because it's 9, so 12 hours would be 9 p.m., right? So yeah, 11 hours. Wish us luck. You really make me want to fly Cross my heart and hope to die Lonely, you're the reason why I can feel those butterflies when I go to sleep at night. Finally know the reasons 
reason why, yeah. I'm never really satisfied. All right, we are out on our field and we are setting up some corn and mineral water so that the deer, uh, the mineral water is really just for the deer's horns to grow in good and healthy. And um, Tyler did an awesome job of cutting down some of these weeds so I don't get ticks all over me. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna just set this up. It is hot out here, y'all. I'm thinking we're gonna need to run by the pool after we do our yard work today. It is hot, hot, hot. but I will show you a before and after that way you can kind of have an idea of what we're dealing with because let me just tell you where it needs to be weed whacked in the front yard looks real bad and we actually bought some hedge trimmers okay so this is the backyard it's a little grown up this is like maybe two weeks of not mowing I think I'll help you with that in a second, babe. The gas. So you can see. Alright. I'm going to have to move my car. But this is kind of what we're dealing with here. Is these rose bushes that are getting choked. And whatever this thing is, this grows fast and furious. So. I got some hedge trimmers to knock that big guy out. And this is going to be kind of what I'll be tackling today, all this mess. And then basically any areas that Tyler can't reach with the mower, I will be getting with the weed whacker. And honestly at this point, I'm really looking forward to a swim in the pool because it is just nasty out here. Actually, it's, I'm in the shade and the wind is blowing right now and it's not that bad but I know once we get going it's gonna be it's it's really too late for us to be doing yard work but the dew on the grass kind of makes it hard in the morning to mow so anyways we're still fasting we're doing a good job with that we have not eaten anything yet just chugging water like there's no tomorrow I uh, will show you guys an after view hopefully if I'm not like sprinting for the pool by then and yeah we'll see y'all in a minute I caught what I thought was a butterfly because it's you know it's the middle of the day I think it's a moth but it is so beautiful I had to show you guys look at it gorgeous I'm gonna set it free I just want to show you guys Anybody know what mo kind of moth it is? Its wings literally look like it has like flowers on the wings. So wicked cool. Hey guys, so we kind of ran into an issue, but before I talk about that, I did want to show you, I was able to get the weed eating done and it looks so good. So uh, I'm going to show you guys. Weed eating is like one of the most satisfying things you can do, honestly. Oh, it looks so good. Y'all remember that big old, yeah, big old boy. That was right over there. It is gone. It's gone now. Let's see. I did more weed eating than this because... I was preparing for my husband to mow the lawn, 
So I was weed eating around the tree and in the backyard I did some weed eating. Uh, but the problem that we ran into is we've been using my father-in-law's mower and it's been giving us a hard time lately. And well, it decided to die on us. So no mowing got done. However, we are gonna go ahead and get a new mower next weekend, hopefully. So. And I told him, I said, if you're going to get a new mower, it's got to be John Deere. So, I am a huge fan of John Deere. Ever since I was like a little girl, for some reason, I love John Deere. I love their products. I love who they are, what they stand for, and the farming world, and everything like that. So, anyways, it's probably weird, but... Is there like a spot on my camera? Yeah, there is. Dang, I'm sorry about that. I don't know how long that was on there. So I am, hope we're hopefully gonna be hopping in the pool here pretty quick. Um, His parents have a, a big old pool. So I am covered in grass. I don't know if you can tell or not, but you probably cannot on camera, but I am just feeling so nasty. Hop in the pool and then we still have not eaten. We are drinking a lot of water, doing good with that. Let's see, it is now 1.30. So we have only got, let's see. What is it, six or seven hours until we eat? So that's not too bad. And I feel like if I go swimming, I will kind of not be watching the clock, you know, and it'll help a little bit because I'm definitely hungry. Just, it's manageable right now. So, anyways, if I don't update you guys at the pool, this is going to be the end of the vlog. So, thank you so much for watching today, guys. I'm going to be posting more about my intermittent fasting journey and how it's been working for me. So far, I have lost 8 pounds, but our our scale, okay, I should say not our scale, but our um, flooring is not level, so our scale can sometimes like be messed up or whatever, so I'm not even sure exactly how much I've actually lost. It doesn't seem like I've lost any weight, to be, to be completely honest with you guys. But, um, I will keep you guys updated. Again, I've only been on this for a week, and I know to get results on something like this, I need to go at least a few months before I really see the results I want to see. So, anyways, I'll keep you guys updated. Comment below if you've done intermittent fasting before and what your tips and tricks are. Basically, I am not doing anything but drinking water. And I've tried drinking black coffee before and it was just like a no-go for me. So, gotta have a little bit of creamer or something. And I've, I read online that you could do almond milk, but like almond milk still has, you know, calories. So, I am, we are just gonna do water. So anyways, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week.